Welcome to one of the last great relics in the NFL, Arrowhead Stadium, for this afternoon's matchup between the Carolina Panthers and the Kansas City Chiefs. We got a crossover conference game about to kick off here. Any thoughts before kickoff, Bill? Well, these two teams don't know each other very well. So when you don't know the other team real well, you know what happens? You get surprised. A lot of big plays. This will be fun to watch. That little wiggle just left the defender standing there. Charles is lined up in a single back formation. First and 10, Jamal Charles carries the football and a gain of four. And that's the type of run I think this offense would take all game long, Phil. Oh, would they ever. They would love this. This is, this is showing your dominance here. The offensive line doing a good job, but also solid job by the running back picking up some good yards. Jamal Charles is in the backfield. He's looking to the right here on this throw. Quentin Michael makes the tackle. Don't see enough of this in the NFL anymore. The out route. Everybody's afraid to throw it. They want all those little safe dink and dunks inside. But that is a nice throw and catch by the quarterback and wide receiver. Lined up in the pistol formation. First and ten. Challenging the defenders to the right side. The Chiefs get a first down. They pounce on him there. It didn't take long, but they're already in scoring territory inside the red zone. Yeah, they're making it look easy, aren't they, so far? But you've got to be alert on the defensive side right now because this offense loves to go for the touchdown once they get into the red zone. This play set up by the long gainer. They're setting up screen. And they knock him down just a yard away from the first. Always a good job to pick up some yards when you're in the red zone. Nice throw by the quarterback, and he gets the completion. And here we have second down. And they'll give it to Jamal Charles. Wide to the left. The Chiefs are in the end zone for the touchdown. Good job on that touchdown. That puts them ahead. And it's always, of course, better to be ahead than behind. Extra point is good. Chiefs getting set for kickoff. Spins away from the hit. Williams is in the backfield. First and ten. Running to his right. Escapes the hit. on the stop. Cam Newton led Auburn to a national title as a quarterback, and how about the NFL? He can throw it down the field, and he can run down the field. That was a nice run that time by Big Cam. First down here after the run. Trying the right side. The tackle was made by Johnson. It's a mindset. It's a culture. That's what you've got to create when you talk about running the football. And when you get it going the right way, you can grind a defense up. Another first down for this offense running the football. They've got him behind the line of scrimmage. When you make play calls like that, you're not going to win many football games. That was a terrible call here on first down. Williams is in the backfield. Second and 13, the throw to the left. In his hands, complete, touchdown. 
Well, here we are. It's a tie game now. We'll see how the teams react to it. Will it be positive or negative? Inside of the uprights. Panthers ready to get the big skin in the air. Just across the 20 and tackled at the 21. Charles is lined up behind his quarterback as the single back. They bring him to the turf. Take it right from the center. Second and eight. Set up screen. Secures it with two hands. The tackle's going to be made, but he's beyond the first down marker. Well, I think we've heard this expression about 7,000 times. It's a passing league, so we all know that. So you got to be able to throw the football and pick up some first downs. the line after that catch for a first down and they'll run the football with Charles nowhere else to go and he's out of bounds an off tackle run it's a staple of all offenses in the NFL and a general rule is you run off the right tackle because he is the power tackle where the left tackle is the pass blocker Fasano's move from the tight end position to the slot. Reaches out and snatches it. Good piece of tackling. Well, it's a great feeling, isn't it, for an offense to throw a short pass to the running back and get a long game. This guy is in there because he can run it, he can catch it, and he can make things happen. First and ten. Looking for an open receiver on the right. 21-yard pickup. The quarterbacks and receivers in this NFL now are so good. It's so easy for them to throw and catch and just keep picking up those first downs. After the long game, let's see what they do here. The Chiefs offense still in gear, hoping to pick up where it left off at the end of the first. the first snap after the big play. Jamal Charles. Fasano's usually a tight end, but he's in the backfield this time. Ball is caught. Good job by the quarterback that time, makes the decision, throws it short, it does not get the first down, but I promise you, third and short is a lot easier than having third and long. Jamal Charles is in the backfield, running to the left side, he steps out. Oh, we got us a nice drive going here, Jim. Another first down. They are just making one solid play after another and just marching down the field. The Chiefs come out in the pistol. First and ten. They feed him the ball again. They got him down there. Good job that time by the offense. They pick up a first down inside the 20-yard line. Now we'll see if they can punch it in and get seven points. New set of downs now after picking up the first on the ground. Three-step drop. 
looking to the right side and throwing. Anytime you get a chance as a defender in your own end zone to knock it down, that's what you do. Nice play by the defensive guy. This long drive continues. Second and goal from the four. The interception. And here he goes. Got to stay aggressive on the defensive side. That time the defense did. Even though the offense was going in to score, they finally, they come up with the big play and they get the interception inside their own 20 yard line. Williams is in the backfield. First and 10. Pass is made, but the hit knocks the ball out incomplete. That's interesting as you watch the receiver trying to make that catch. He knew the defender was close, so he didn't put all of his heart into it. The defender made a nice hit and knocks the football out to the ground. That leads us to second down. He has the grab. Touchdown! Well, when your offense goes out there and scores a touchdown to put you ahead, it's got to give a big lift to the defense. they got to get excited and go out there and hold that lead. Add the extra point. The kick is good. The Chiefs are anxious to return the kickoff. Take it right from the center. Now first to ten. Jamal Charles carries the football. Good job of the defensive line standing in there and fighting, and they hold the running back to a short game. Bill, one of the big stories this year about the Chiefs is the new regime here with Andy Reid now, the head coach. Yeah, Jim, change is good sometimes. You know, Andy Reid in Philadelphia for so long, and it's like the town was tired of him. The players are not listening. Now he gets a fresh start in Kansas City, and Andy Reid's track record speaks for itself. He's a pretty good coach. Well, you're right when you talk about Reid. Tremendous track record there in Philadelphia. So many years in the playoffs, one time to the Super Bowl. Now he comes to Kansas City, brings in Alex Smith, and he's ready now to bring new life to this franchise. Yeah, and they're starving for some victories out there in Kansas City. So I know the fan base, the organization, the players all got to be excited because Andy Reid is taking over. So that, that's a big thing for the team. So you got a motion on your side. Now just get that team organized a little bit. They do have some hidden talent. It should be a successful year for Andy Reid. Fasano's shifted from tight end to a receiver in the slot. He's got the grab, and he's got the first. That's a good play that time by the offensive coordinator. Fourth down try. He makes the right call, and they pick up the first down. Setting up in the pistol on this play. Throwing now to his left. Caught it. But his feet are out of bounds. Now the defense got away with one that time. It wasn't a good play in their part. It was just bad timing by the quarterback and receiver. Play number six coming up on this drive. He's in the clear. Warning. That's an excellent job. Just get enough yardage to get the first down, move those chains, and keep this offense going. Let's see what they do on first down following that huge play. Throws to the right. 
offense out of the tackle. And that last play made by Quentin Michael. Nice throw that time by the quarterback in the red zone. Gets a completion. And there's some tight spots. Not a lot of room. So you got to really drive the football in there. The Panthers will come out in the dime. Got a little screen set up here. Shakes off the tackle. Going to be a tackle for a loss. Well, that's the new NFL. Just keep throwing it behind the line of scrimmage and see if the athletes can catch it and make some yards. None there that time. A loss of a couple yards. to snap it for the ninth play of the drive. Third and ten. That ball was picked off. <laughs> Wonderful job by the defense that time. They stayed after it. And inside their own 20, they finally come up with a play. They get the interception, and they keep the other team from getting points on the board. Offense lines up here. First and 10. Here's the handoff, and they'll run it. Well, they call you an outside linebacker for a reason. That means you play outside and you stop the wide runs by the offense, and he did it that time. Good job, makes the tackle. And this will be second down. He's looking to the right here on this throw, and it's incomplete, just couldn't hold on to it after the hit. Good job that time, Jim, by the defender. He hit that receiver so hard, that football came flying out. That's why it's incomplete, the big hit by the defender. It's a dime look for the defense on this play. It'll be a third and 10. Makes the grab and keeps the ball moving down the field. That's a first down catch. Oh, the, we've got an injured player on the field. Well, Jim, I know his family's watching, so We'll give all the information we can as soon as we get it, but it looks like it could be a major injury, and I just, well, I hope the best. First down here after the completion. Brings it in. They break through. Tackle them behind the line. Now the play is there to be made, but the offensive player doesn't get it done. Bad job on first down. down now challenging the defenders to the right side that'll put them in what we call plus territory Jim they got momentum on their side right now they are making everything work that was a nice play they pick up another first down and they got a good drive going here that long gain sets them up here on this play and intercepted tackles made what a terrible job by the players. Nobody's open, tries to force the pass, and look, what's it turned into an interception. Split backfield here, and they'll give it to Jamal Charles. They go to the right side. Quentin Michael makes the tackle. That was a running play that time by the offense. It picked up some good yards, nothing like it. Show the defense you're willing to get in there and slug it out and get some tough running yards. Charles Johnson gets to him for the sack. Ah, uh, not a good job by the quarterback that time. Inside of two minutes in the first half, you got to get rid of the football. Nobody's open, just throw it away. That time, he loses yards by taking the sack. We're back here now in this one, where the Panthers are leading by seven. Breaks the tackle.
in the backfield. Williams going to take the handoff now. Jim, sooner or later, if you get these situations, you got to throw the football. As we have seen today, they keep trying to run it, but there's not much there to go. Second down and seven. On the money. That's what you want to do, just get a first down, especially when you're on top. Keep the clock moving. Keep the defense guessing. Make them react instead of attack. They've got a first down now after that catch. And Williams is handed the football. D'Angelo Williams with a nice piece of running on that play. Well, the long run that time, and there's a lot of reasons why they got that long run. But the, the biggest one, the good blocking up front, but what patience for the running back. He did not panic because it took a while for that running lane to develop. When it did, he saw it, he hit it, and he used his talents to get down the field for the big game. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. Cam Newton takes it from the shotgun. Incompletion there, just not quite able to get the feet down. The defense has got to be a little aggressive here. Your team is down. You've got to attack this offense. You don't want them to get in there and get another score. Wake up. Williams is in the backfield. He'll fire it out to the left. Oh, it almost picks off that time. It was a jump ball, in essence, for that throw, and in the end, the defense was able to make the play and deny the completion. In the NFL, it's always about the most physical guy wins, and that time it was the defensive player. Good job. The offense heads to the line for the seventh play of the drive. Very nearly intercepted. Well, nice situation here for the offense. They're winning the football game. Now they're in the red zone. Let's see if they can come up with a play that fools the defense. Loading up with extra defensive backs in the dime. Throws the pass. They fail to convert here on fourth down. Well, they don't get it on fourth down. That was, man, that was a quick drive, wasn't it, Jim? That was just bad play calling, bad execution, and go to the sideline. That's where you deserve to be. The Panthers go with the dime formation here on defense. First and ten. Looking for an open receiver on the right. He's going to be tackled right around the 24-yard line. Well, that was a nice job by the offense. It just puts him in a better position. Nice little throw and catch. Alex Smith will take it right from the center. Second and short. Quarterback drops back. Play action. He makes the catch. Well, when your team is behind, what do you do? Just come out there and get a first down. That's a nice job by the offense. That reception gave them the first down. Smith's going to throw once again on this down. Makes the grab. They bring him down at the 41-yard line. Well, I guess the best thing to say there, Jim, is they completed the pass, but it still did not get a first down. After that grab, it's now second down and two. Makes the catch. And he's brought to the ground. Well, it does look like much, but it really serves the purpose. Picks up the first down, and now they have a chance to open things up. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. Now in rhythm, the quarterback drops back. Quinton Michael with the pick. That brings the play to an end. That was a terrible throw by the quarterback. When you're off target like that, you deserve to throw an interception. They come to the line of scrimmage. First down. Williams going to secure the handoff. The outside linebacker that time just did his job very well. And gets in there and makes the tackle for very little gain. The defense comes out in the nickel. Looking to the right side and throwing. He had it, but the hit jars the ball loose. 
Good timing by the defensive player that time. He gets to the receiver just as the football is getting there and makes the hit, knocks that football loose. Williams is in the backfield. Third and ten. Caught. This offense can't be stopped on third down no matter the distance. Perfect defense call that time. They allow the catch. The coach on the sidelines going, well, what else do you want me to do? We had the guy double covered, and you still couldn't make the play. Newton in shotgun formation. Loads it up. It's going deep. In the books. Touchdown. How about this gift? A wide open receiver down the field. The quarterback, good job of finding. He throws it down there, and he gets the easy touchdown. Makes the PAT. Panthers ready to get the pigskin in the air. He had nowhere to go, and they deck him at the 16-yard line. They face first down. Screen play is on. He is tackled at the 40-yard line. formation a tackle behind the line so many things you can do on first down and what do you come up you come up with that play that was just a bad play call second down and 11 throws to the right and he's brought down right at the 42 when the defense is going to play safe and they don't want you to run by him you've got to be able to throw these out routes where the receivers cutting towards the sideline and the quarterback Stick it in there. What a hit, and the ball falls incomplete. This defense you're playing against, they're pretty good. So it's fourth down near midfield, punt the football. The quarterback is coming to the line hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. Well, they're a gambling football team. They like to take chances. Even though they're down, it's in the second half. They take another chance. They go for it on fourth, and this time they got it. He's looking to the right here on this throw. Good job by the receiver that time. Getting that extra couple yards, gets a first down. They are marching. Let's see how the defense reacts. First down here after the completion. Alex Smith's going to take it from the shotgun. Oh, bad decision that time by the quarterback. He tries to force the football into the end zone and it almost gets picked off by the defense. Fasano's in the slot here for this play. Alex Smith looking long. Touchdown. That'll close the gap. Nice throw by the quarterback that time. Put it right on the money. Not a big window. It doesn't matter to him today. Great control of the football. Put it right in there for the touchdown. Ryan Suckup ready for the kickoff. And Ted again will get a chance here on the kickoff. And the tackle is made right around. 32-yard line. Offense lines up here. First down and 10. They tackle him for a loss. Good job by the defense. They stopped the first down play that time by the offense, and now they have a good situation. Getting sacked. That's what all defensive coordinators love to see. When they don't have to blitz, and one of their defensive linemen gets a sack without any blitzing. From the gun.
challenging the defenders to the right side. There's the tackle, but still, it's enough for the first down. And that's going to do it for the third quarter. We'll be back from Kansas City for the start of the fourth after the break. That was a big gainer. Now it's time to back it up. Slashes to the left side. That juke gets him some space. Now they take the football onto the opponent's side of the field. Good job that time by the running back. I'm sure he's a little winded after that play. He showed that speed getting out there and picking up those extra yards. First and ten. Cam Newton unleashes the long pass. Someone's been injured out there. Hold on a minute. Well, after watching that play, I think it's safe to say you can tell uh, it's an injury to the lower body. Really big hit. Uh, feel bad for the guy. I hope he's okay. Looking for an open receiver on the right. And almost picked off. This is frustrating for a coach. You call a play, you get the receiver down the field on a quarter route, and your quarterback cannot put it on the target. Play number six coming up on this drive. Almost intercepted. Oh. Good anticipation that time by the defender. He gets to the receiver just as the football is arriving, and he makes a beautiful hit to knock the football loose. Williams is in the backfield. He'll throw it over the middle. The Panthers now move the chains. Got to have a lot of courage to call these type of plays, don't you, Jim? And, and at that time, even though this team is winning, the coach decides to go for it on fourth down. Good play call, and they make it work. They've got a first down now after that catch. Looking to the right side and throwing. Incomplete, almost going in the other direction. And that was a battle for the football, Phil. That time, the defense won out incomplete. Yeah, nice job, Jim. That time by the defensive back just being aggressive and get, and making sure the receiver could not make the catch. Williams lined up directly behind the quarterback here. Second and ten. Williams, left side. D'Angelo Williams with a nice piece of running on that play. When you start out in bad field position, it's up to the coach to get you out of it. What a job by the coordinator. They have marched down the field. Now they're inside the red zone. Let's see if they can score. First and ten. And they sack the quarterback. There's a couple ways to get to the quarterback, run over the tackle, or run around him. It doesn't matter as long as you get the sack. Marching down the field and taking their time. Cam Newton takes it from the shotgun, trying to work that left side. Intercepted! This defensive coordinator, he is one aggressive dude. He keeps going after this offense, and finally he gets the interception inside uh, their own 20-yard line and stops the offense from getting any points. The Chiefs will go with the pistol on this play. Charles has got it on the handoff. Into the open now as he crosses the first down marker. City. There's no doubt about it. When you score like that to tie up the game, it shifts momentum. And it's all up now to the offense of the other team to get back out there and get the momentum back on their side. The Panthers are prepared to return the kickoff. And Ted again will get a chance here on the kickoff. Nothing like a good return when you talk about special teams. Good blocking, the speed of the returner gets down the field, and after that tackle, now they have good starting field position. First 
first and ten, D'Angelo Williams to the right side. D'Angelo Williams with a nice piece of running on that play. Well, we were at practice on Friday, Jim. This team was working on red zone offense all the time. Well, here they are. It's a tie game. We'll see if all that practice pays off. time by the offense scoring that touchdown and putting him ahead and when you get ahead in a football game the National Football League it makes you relax and you play better no it's not it's a fake so from two yards out they get it across and secure two extra points the Chiefs are anxious to return the kickoff The move and he's free. And he's tackled just past the 20. We'll mark it at the 22 yard line. Get ready. Right, but this one's running up, and the defense knows it needs another stop. And he's tackled at the 30 yard line. Here comes the training staff as we've got a player down on the field. I don't even want to speculate what the injury is, but I think it's safe to say by just watching the player, he's in a lot of pain, and I hope it's not serious. Smith standing back in the shotgun ready for the snap. There has been good pass protection for the quarterback all day long. He has not been sacked much, and he throws it there and gets another completion. This is a time where the quarterback has to manage the clock, has to be very careful. Trailing, needing points to get back into this one. Has a terrible read by the running back. It's a short game, but it's all his fault. He picked the wrong hole. He should have cut it back. He didn't, and that's why he was tackled. Good job by the play caller that time. Calling for the short pass, even though it comes up short of the first down, it opens up many things that you can do on third. You can run a reverse, draw plays, screen plays, or if you want, you can still throw it down the field. I think the best thing to say about that play, it's just a, it gained a few yards, so that's what you do. All plays don't score. Sometimes you just want to pick up a couple yards. Fasano's playing out of position in the backfield here. And a completion this time. That'll stop the play right there. Jim, this time it's a halfback screen. Nice job by the quarterback. The halfback, good job after catching it, picked up some good yards. Two-minute warning. Close, and the defense is trying to preserve a victory. Touchdown. At this game, just got a whole lot more interesting. What a tough throw and catch into a tight spot right there for the touchdown. But today's game, these players are so good that you have to throw it in traffic. they got to make the catch. That time he did. They'll get set, looking to convert on this two-point try. Smith from the gun. Gets away from the pressure, and they will not convert here on the two-point conversion. Good stand by the defense. They're lining up for the onside kick. They want to get the ball back. The onside kick is turned away, and the receiving team has it. And that's a big tackle behind the line of scrimmage.
setting up in the pistol on this play. They motion the receiver around to the other side. First and ten. And Williams is taking the handoff. Four yards. What a good job by the defensive player there. Just flushing the running back and driving him into the ground. Williams lined up now as the running back behind the quarterback. The wide receiver in motion. Second and six. Williams going to take the handoff now. He'll be brought down, but not before picking up the first down. Nothing fancy about that, but it's a good run. Gets a first down. Now the offense has three more chances. The Panthers in the pistol. Again, going to lose yards here. Good job by the defense. They stopped the offense that time on first down. Now the defense is in a good situation. The Panthers will approach this play from out of the pistol. The wide receiver shifting around in motion. Second and 12. Another handoff. Swallowed up behind the line of scrimmage. Well, Jim, that is for the defense at all. Second down, you run the football, hoping to make it third and short. Then you lose yards, third longs. They're hard to get in the NFL. And 17 looks to his left. The pass is made and it's incomplete. The hit jars the ball out. The defense comes out of the nickel. Play action, throws to the right. He brings it in here, and he's got the first. Nice job by the coach that time going forward on fourth down. His team is up here in the second half. He wants to keep momentum on his side. That's why he goes for it, and they get it. A tightly contested contest that has now come to a conclusion. It was a nail-biter. It 